Okay, here we go. This is dissection 14, the medial lower leg muscles of our cat. Okay, you're noticing again we are on the medial surface. Pretty common mistake is that people um, people accidentally um, think this is the lateral surface of the leg, but we uh, we are on the inside. First step you're noticing is we got to dig through some of this fascia, this uh, white fibrous tissue that's all over the place. You might need to um, be kind of careful that you don't accidentally completely remove the gracilis, but you can partially kind of fold him back a little bit. Our first muscle we're going to locate here is the uh, gastrocnemius. It's a big calf muscle. It's basically what we would call your calf. We, know, we now know that a lot of those muscles that we know so well, like the hamstring, quadriceps, calf, they actually have much more scientific names. Okay, so we're just kind of exposing this. Um, I believe during this video uh, my camera runs out of battery, so we'll do a quick uh, transition here. So just want to show you we're removing fascia all over the place, removing it off of the sides. And I'm going to use scissors to kind of help me out here as I remove and clean it up. And I think right about now is when the video times out. Okay, so let's go to the other video real quick. All right, so we're back. We're still cleaning off the fascia. I see the gastrocnemius. Let's pause, or actually keep this thing going for a moment. Notice how I'm getting underneath the gastrocnemius. Okay, pretty big muscle, very large. The next muscle that you're going to see is something called the flexor digitorum longus. So let's see here if I can get rid of this little window. Oh, nope, it's not. Okay. So gastrocnemius. Up here you're going to see the flexor digitorum longus, not to be confused with the digitorum lateralis that we saw on the arm. This is on the leg, of course. Let's watch this dissection go through. You're also going to notice the tibia. Your tibia is going to be kind of a good uh, landmark in this situation. Okay, I'm just peeling away the fascia that's covering the tibia. And hopefully I'm going to find a muscle on the other side of the tibia called the tibialis anterior. Kind of a logical sounding name. Tibialis anterior. So you're going to find a white bone of the tibia. Behind the tibia is the flexor digitorum longus and in front of it is the tibialis anterior. And I'm just again working on that gastrocnemius, clearing away some of the fascia, and I'm even starting to work on the lateral side of the leg, again removing as much fascia as I can. I'm actually partially removing, partially separating the biceps femoris on the lateral side, just getting ready for the last final dissection, number 15, which will be our next video. All right, again, Pretty good layer of white fibrous tissue, fascia on this. You can see how my probe's getting under it. I want to remove as much of this as I can so I can see all the muscle detail. You can see as my probe works its way around. And this is, again, very similar to what we did when we dissected the arms of the cat. Okay, that looks pretty good. Uh, I guess one other thing that we can say that we can see on this uh, dissection would also have to be the, um, right by my left finger there, you can see the Achilles tendon also coming up here, okay? Let's get this thing to play again. Get rid of this little black box at the bottom that's kind of blocking our view. Okay, again, that's the flexor digitorum longus. Tibialis anterior is right there on the shin, kind of at the very front of the uh, leg. A lot of what people have something we call shin splints. It involves the inflammation of all this fascia that's holding these muscles to the tibia. We call them shin splints. It's just an inflammation of fascia. Very common running injury.
Again, there's still even another thick layer of this fascia. I'm going to remove that and then should be ready for dissection 15 to follow this immediately. There we go. You can actually now see the muscle's been exposed. Very important that you do this for dissection 15. So make sure you've removed all the fascia off the surface. We'll have a good view of this in the future here. Okay. This would be a great time for me to label these muscles really quickly here. Okay, so we have the gastrocnemius. So this long muscle right here, this kind of big, thick guy. We have the flexor digitorum longus and the tibialis anterior. And back here is the Achilles tendon. Okay, so there's only four structures you need to know. Yes, the tibia, you already know that bone, but that's not going to be on your test. I'm not testing you on bones. All right, so that's it. We'll see you guys in class for the dissection.